Hi, my name is Jeff Thibodeau. I'm a professional real estate coach and trainer. And today I'm going to be showing you how to use artificial intelligence, specifically the free chat GPT tool to write your listing descriptions. Now, once you learn how to do this, it's going to save you all kinds of time. And hopefully your mind's going to be spinning with other ways you can use this in your business. But today I want to give you a concrete example. And I actually want to give you all the tools you need to do this. So the first thing we need, <clears throat> okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to use the free artificial intelligence called Chat GPT to write your professional listing descriptions for your properties. Now this video is perfect if you're a real estate agent here in North America and you struggle with writing real estate listing descriptions. Not all of us are born copywriters, uh, but we're good at selling real estate and knowing the best features at a home. So we're going to let the artificial intelligence do the work. Now, in this video, I'm going to give you everything you need to be able to do this in a cut and paste way. So stay tuned and also look in the description below for everything you need to do this. So the first thing you need to do is have an account over here at chat.openai. So just head over to this URL and you're going to need to create your own account and you're going to end up on a screen like this. The screen's super simple. You have a chat window down here in the bottom, and this is how you interact with this artificial intelligence. Now, we're not gonna go into depth in this video on how the AI works, but just know it's been trained by reading over 10% of the entire internet. So that means it's read tons of real estate listings and it knows what's good and what's bad. It's also read lots of information on being a copywriter and a good writer and a persuasive marketer. So it knows all of these things. Now you can play in this chat box and do all kinds of fun things with the artificial intelligence. But the key thing you're gonna find when you go to work with this tool is that being able to write the instructions is the key step in making this a successful endeavor for you. So that's what I'm gonna show you how to do today. And in fact, I've done it all for you. You can just copy and paste my instructions. Now in the AI world, they're gonna call this a prompt. So that's what I have over here in this notepad. And all this information here on the notepad is over in the description for this video. So if you uh, want to see a little sample, I can go into the, the chat here and just say, hello, I need help writing my real estate listing, whoops, listing descriptions. And the AI is going to write back to us. Oh, it's already providing some helpful things for us. Now, I'm just showing you how this works. You don't have to do this step. Um, what you need to do is have an account and remember it's free. So just go ahead and create your free account. And then what you wanna do is come in here and use a really great prompt. Oh, so this is great, check this out. It's telling us we wanna focus on attractive features, be descriptive, paint a picture for the buyer, keep it concise, use keywords. That's great advice, thanks. Well, well, it's wrapping up here. Um, I'm gonna go over here and show you what I've written for my prompt. So a prompt is the instructions we're gonna give to the AI. And these instructions, the more specific, the better the result. And so I've taken a minute to craft this and actually I use the AI to help me craft it. We'll get into that in a whole nother video. But what I've said here is, as a professional copywriter, craft a compelling listing description for a residential property in North America utilizing industry standards and persuasive tone. Then I said, highlight the property's advantages, appealing to a potential buyer's emotions, and write it in the active voice. This description should be between 1,000 to 2,000 characters in length. And now that's just my local MLS system only allows up to 2,000 characters. So I don't want it to be too short and I don't want it to be too long. So feel free to change that to comply with your local MLS, or if you're looking for something longer for your own property flyer, feel free, you can change this to characters or you could put in the number of words you want it to be. Um, and then I've put here, please use the information below to write the description. And then I said, please provide me three options separated by uh, three dashes. And this is because um, you want some options and the, it doesn't cost you any more to get three instead of one. So you could say, write me 10 options if you want. So that's the prompt. And basically what you have to do is just simply cut and paste this or 
write your own, change it up a little bit with a different set of instructions, but then you wanna save this prompt. So you don't wanna type this out every time, you just wanna cut and paste it. Okay, then the information provided, so this is what we're gonna to use to write this description. Again, um, you would wanna have this saved just as the bolded areas here. And I've just went ahead and filled in a hypothetical fake property here. So the property address, in here, you're gonna to wanna to fill in the actual address of the property with the proper city name, state or province. Remember what you use is what it's gonna use. So don't use abbreviations or short forms here. Under the property details section, this is where we wanna put in things like the bedrooms, the bathrooms, the square footage, any key major features. Like I here I put in an indoor pool, a detached three car garage and a greenhouse. But you're gonna choose what you want under the details. And then I'm gonna highlight two different sections, the best features of the property and the best features of the area. And as a real estate agent, you should have no problem listing these things out. Where the problem is, is writing them all in, in colorful language and having it all like flow together. So don't worry about that. All you have to do is just put them in with commas. For here, for example, I put in modern architecture, large windows built in 2021, so on and so forth, all the way down to you know games room, theater room, sunrise from the back deck. Then under the features of the area, here you can highlight the neighborhood or the city or the amenities close by. Uh, for this property I put in, it's a private two acre lot surrounded by trees, it's a gated community, close to highway access, private schools nearby, farmer's market, craft brewery. So again, you can see as long as you've been out to the property and you know what the best features are, you just list them all off here. And then last I added this section just to make sure it doesn't miss anything. Um, this section please highlight so anything you really want it to make sure it touches on, uh, put in here. So for example, I put that it was custom built and there's luxury finishes throughout. So all you have to do is copy this um, from the description below and then add your information into a notepad like this. And then simply we're gonna highlight this whole thing. Okay, I'm gonna copy this. And then I'm gonna come over here to the chat window and I'm gonna paste it in here and I'm gonna send the command and then watch the magic happen. Okay, sometimes the system's a little busy, but just let it do its thing. Remember, it is a free system, so you can't get too upset at it. I will say while this is going, sometimes you'll come to this system and it'll say it's bogged down. Um, you're just gonna to have to come back. That's one of the disadvantages of a free system. There are paid accounts and tools. One is called Jasper AI. They basically use the same underlying framework, uh, but you do pay for an account, so you don't have to worry about the speed or being kind of locked out. So now you see the AI is writing. It's writing live, just like a professional copywriter. It's thinking word by word and writing these sentences out using all the instructions we gave it. And it looks like it's finished up option one, and it's going to go and take another shot at it. And we're just going to let it finish up here. You can kind of read along as it's generating the information here. It's always amazing to me as I watch this, even though I've used it a few hundred times now, uh, watching it just create, you know, professional copywriting out of thin air is really quite impressive. You think about how long this might take you to write this and check it all and make sure it's grammatically correct um, and the amount of time you could save. Now, if you run a team or a brokerage, you could be providing this as a service for all the agents um, right from your marketing department. Okay, so now we've got three options. I'm just gonna pick one of them to read. Let's look at option number two. Now, it used all the same information. It's just given us different variety because it does have some randomness and some creativity built into it. So let's take a look at this one. Discover the perfect blend of luxury and nature at 123 Kings Lane in Springfield, Ohio. This five bedroom, four and a half bath home features 3,200 square feet of living space, plus a finished basement with indoor pool, all within a private gated community surrounded by trees. Custom built in 2021, this property boasts modern architecture, large windows, and an open concept layout. The heart of the home, the amazing master suite offers a spa bath and double walk-in shower, while the games room, theater room, and back deck provide plenty of opportunities to unwind. Enjoy the convenience of living close to highway access, with a private school and farmer's market nearby. Plus, a nearby craft brewery offers a taste of the local flavor. 
This home is a true, this home is truly a haven with luxury finishes throughout and a private two acre lot. Come see for yourself why 123 Kings Lane is the perfect place to call home. Wow, that's pretty impressive. Now I did leave out a couple different things um, and I'm sure we'll find them in the other options. So what you can do here is pick and choose. You can take one of these and edit it, or you can perhaps ask for another option four. Um, before we wrap it up here, I wanna show you a couple of cool things you can do with this. Um, now that we have this all ready to go and we've already written our listing description, you can have it do other things for you. Like for example, um, I can write thanks. I always like to be polite to the AI. Um, can you write me a caption for my Instagram post based on option two? And now it's gonna take the information. It knows everything it's already chatted with you about, just like a person would. And it's gonna shorten it up and make it nice and concise. And it's even picked a few hashtags. Again, maybe we want to do a video tour of this property. So I'm gonna write, thanks. Can you write me a video script? Oops. To make a tour video of this property. Let it do its thing. It's gonna act as our Hollywood director here. And it's gonna give our script and also tell us the shots to take. And this is really cool because you could print this out and bring it to your video shoot with your videographer and you'd be well on your way to creating a great listing video tour. Or you could have your videographer shoot this and then you could just provide a voiceover um, afterwards. So many options available really. So as this finishes up, I'm just gonna recap what we've done here today. Um, remember, everything you need is down in the description below this video. All you need to do is cut and paste the information that I've provided, the prompt, and fill in your own blanks. You wanna head over to OpenAI and get yourself an account if you don't have one, and then head into the chat GPT section of OpenAI. And you literally just have to cut and paste this into the chat box and see your results. Remember, the AI knows everything in the previous chat, so you can keep prompting it. You can ask it to revise things. You can ask it to make it funnier um, and see where it goes from there. Wait, before we wrap up, why don't we try that? Uh, tell me a joke about this property. Let's see what this does. Haha, <laughs> why did the property at 123 Kings Lane have a three car garage and a workshop? Because it needed a place to store all its crowns. Haha. -ha. Well, I didn't say it was a good comedian, but isn't this amazing? I hope you found this video useful. And if you did, we're doing all kinds of trainings like this over on our new app, Agent Pro. So search for it in the App Store or check the links below. And I hope you found this video useful. Please leave me a like or a comment if I can provide anything for you or show you how to do anything else cool with this tool.